Behold the Dark Ages. We have no power at all. I don't know why I'm closing that door. I'm going to put this up here a little bit. I hope that that is okay. Can it's they see me? No. No, no one can see me? They can kind of, oh, I guess. Oh, I can do a different setting. Let me look here. Do, 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 do. Oh, oh. Oh, my. There we go. How about that? There we go. That's that better. Good? Yeah. Well, anyways, we have no power at all. Uh, it is the middle of the night. We've had no power for 30 hours. So, uh... I can't do my job right now without power. That's or Wi-Fi. How it works, or internet. That's just kind of the uh, failure of uh, of this setup here. But I did want to kind of touch base with you guys because I'm not going to make this like a weird, like deep thing about how like we as a society rely on electricity and all this stuff. Although I will say, try turning it off for 30 hours. It's a bit of a pain in the ass. The thing is. We are trying to catch up, but uh, have really no way to right now. So, if the power does not come back on tomorrow, what we're going to have to do is rent a hotel room, just eat the cost on it. I am literally going to write that off as a business expense because there's nothing I can do right now. And uh, that's going to be what it is. And then we're going to have to work all day from a hotel room to kind of keep up with everything. The last of what was scheduled to go up is up. Like, I have videos done. And I have a Doctor Strange review that I was literally ready to record last night. And as soon as I got up to do it, boom. Like, there was a massive storm. And there were, like, over the last, I don't know, three days, there's been three tornadoes in, the, in, like, the Twin Cities area in Minnesota. Which knocked out tons of power in, like, Minneapolis and St. Paul and all these other places. So, I know most of you don't know Minnesota geography and will never have to bother with it. But... What's weird is it'll be something like power will be out in one place, and then the next place there will be power at the neighbor's house. It's just really random. Uh, and for some reason, our power company doesn't seem to care. So uh, if that happens, we're going to be renting a hotel room, not that any of you care about this, and our videos will be a little weird probably for a couple of days in terms of starting a new Let's Play, because that's probably the best we can do for that channel, along with recording in front of a very neutral wall that is not as cool as it normally is with <laughs> stuff on it uh, because I can't hang things up in a hotel room. Maybe we can bring your comic books and you can hold them. Yeah. Hello. Greetings, <laughs> fellow kids. <laughs> now, that looks too much like a weird humble brag then. I like it as a backdrop, but uh, that would be a bit much. But anyway, basically the reason that I want to make this is because I had nothing to put up and I did actually want to touch base with you guys and talk to you about it just a little bit real quick because... Uh, we're not just being lazy. There's literally nothing we can do. We had worked ahead somewhat before with the Let's Play channel, but the problem was I had only scheduled two days worth of videos because I was really tired the night I was doing it. Then I had tons of errands the next two days. Uh, that is errands, not errands. Although if there are some handsome errands that would like to enter my life, whether they be male, female, or other, that is allowed too. But here's the thing. I really had no time, so that's it for that channel right now until we can get it back up, and then, uh, the double entendre, and then this is pretty much it for this channel, until we can either get a hotel room uh, that is not going to bend us completely over financially, or until the power comes back. I thought I heard them working on it earlier. I also heard some guy with a generator, and I was very envious of him, although it probably is only powering his fridge, but uh, that's kind of the situation we're in. I don't know if Jill has anything to say. That's pretty much all I got. I was going to say pray for us and not being able to heat up any food. Yeah, Jill's eating cold SpaghettiOs for dinner. Well, <laughs> we got like nothing really else. Sad. There's nothing else to eat. We went out to Dairy Queen for lunch. Yeah, like we spent all day out doing errands and stuff for, um, and errands uh, for different things. Like we were trying to change Jill's ID thing and, and some other stuff. And we thought that by the time we got back, we'd be able to do this. Uh, I cleaned the room by lantern light. Like, I'm basically channeling my inner green lantern here with this thing walking <laughs> around the house. I've almost ate dirt quite a few times falling down. So, I don't know. I mean, uh, maybe I'll fall down, hit my head open, and this will be the very last unironic video on the channel. You never know. But, thank you for watching. Hey, Doctor Strange Review is coming out whenever we can. I will say this without spoilers right now. I loved the movie. I've got a lot of things to talk about it with a non-spoiler section and a spoiler section like we always do with newer movies. I know it's a little over a week old now, but uh, I don't want to ruin that for anybody. So that'll be coming up. We've got some top fives we've been working on. I've got a Dark Souls video I've been working on. So there's a lot of different stuff that I just can't 
finish right now. Uh, and the other problem is that most of that is on my gaming PC, which is a massive tower, not on my shitty 2015 laptop that I'd have to use to work at a hotel. So all of that is pretty much going to have to be pushed back, except for the Doctor Strange review, because I hadn't recorded that yet. So I think that if we have to rent a hotel, I can make that work for Sunday, because I think today's Saturday, Sunday or Monday. We'll see. But, uh, you know, prayers and hopes, hopes and prayers. <laughs> they do a lot for people. But, uh, you know, that's it. We should ask them to call our electric company and, like, bombard them with getting our power back on. No, I don't want to. I don't want to dox anyone. <laughs> today, even if they deserve it. Even if they somewhat deserve it. I don't know. Interested to hear your thoughts down below in the comments. I'm not sure what the heck they will be. Maybe you will love this uh, this new setting. Maybe we can kind of take it back to the dark ages and, like, have an aesthetic of like a comic book and video game fan who like lives in caves and only comes out to play the demos in Target and Walmart and then retreats into his cave to record in yeah, the dark. And then know. we can get candles and like you can do it by candlelight. Yeah, and we can do a book club. I don't know. Well, the sky's the limit. I'll see you guys in the next one. Please be sure to check out the links in the description down below. We do have uh, the new Discord, so I am able to use that some because I found a portable battery charger for my phone. We're like really going old school here. And... Uh, that is a lot of fun place to hang out, talk about different things, fallouts. Yeah. I was going to say Skyrim, but Elder Scrolls, Dark Souls, Batman, you know, DC comics, Marvel comics, 007, all, all kinds of stuff. Even Sonic the Hedgehog. Uh, also Patreon is in the description down below. If you want to help support our channel. Uh, and everything else, including Enchanted Glamour, where you can get all kinds of cool stuff. Secretly, the reason our power is out is because we couldn't pay the electricity bill. That's it. We're that poor. <laughs> We're going to start liquidating. <laughs> anyway, let us know what you guys think in the comments down below. Have a fantastic day. And as always, stay shway.